I sure had fun swimming. Mom should be out of the changing room any minute to take us to get ice cream. Good. I have a question for her about human bodies. Yes, Squeaks. Me too. When I was in the changing room, I noticed that some people's bodies have different parts than other people's. What gives? That's a good question, Scoops. Here's Mom. She taught us that our bodies are mostly the same, but also a little different. Explain, please, and make it rhyme. Okay, well, on the outside, we've all got eyes and ears and a nose on our head, arms and hands and nipples on our chests, legs and knees and ankles and toes, and a big old butt that sometimes goes... Scoops. <laughs> Good one. Butt is actually a name for buttocks. I think I get it. Most of our body parts are the same, but some are different. So then, how are we different? Well, most girls have what many people call a vagina, but its proper name is vulva. Your vulva is between your legs at the top, Kayla. And Dad explained to me that most boys have a penis. Well, I've noticed more than that. You're right, Scoops. And under the penis are the testicles. They're located in a sack of skin called the scrotum. And at the tip of the penis is the urethra, where urine or pee comes out. Where does my pee come from? You urinate or pee from a urethra too, but yours is a small hole inside the vulva. The vulva also has inner and outer lips that surround the sensitive area called the clitoris, and a little bit bigger hole behind the urethra that is the opening to the vagina. Wow, people sure do have some cool body parts. Yeah, but they're missing the coolest part of all, a lizard's tail. Scoops. Scoops.